Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer and welcome back to another video. In this video, I want to talk about whether being a criminal in Oblivion is good or not. Now, Oblivion, you can be a criminal because it's an RPG game. Um, the main two criminal organizations you can be a part of is the Thieves Guild and the Dark Brotherhood Guild. And they offer their own perks. The Dark Brotherhood Guild, really just, you murder people, more or less. It's what you do. And the Thieves Guild is you steal stuff. Now, with those two things, you kind of lose access to a lot of different services, but you gain access to services. Um, you can be a good guy, but we're talking about like hardcore criminal, like you're not going to be a good guy. You're probably going to get seen by a guard if you enter a city, so most cities and towns you can't enter at all. You can't really use the roads or the merchants, the main merchants, so you have to rely on the Thief Guild fences, which are actually really good for selling things, and the Dark Brotherhood for just their quests and their gear and the murder stuff. Overall, I would say it's worth it and not, okay? It's really nice having access to all of the merchants and stuff in Oblivion, but let's be real, there's very few characters that actually need to buy things. The only real characters I can think of that need to buy things are characters that require heavy potion use and you need to buy a bunch of alchemy ingredients. It's the only thing I can think of where you really need to not be a criminal. If you're a criminal, you also don't get access to the churches, which I guess, I don't know if you need that or not. But you have access, you can sell stolen goods, so it's pretty easy to make money, right? You just sneak into the Mages Guild or something like that, or someone's store at night. And you have places to, like, run and hide in case you're a murderer. You can go to the Thieves Guild and pay off your bounty for half the price. And I think it's kind of one of the few things that's balanced in Oblivion. I think it's an either-or situation when it comes to being a criminal in Oblivion because then it gives you an excuse to, you know, steal things or maybe someone has something you want, you murder them for it. But then, you know, you also get caught by the guards. Now, if you are a good guy, you don't have access to these services, but you're not going to get caught by the guards. And I think the way that Oblivion is built is perfectly balanced to be either or. I really do. You know, you got to be either sneaky or, um, you know, that's it. Literally, if you're a criminal, you got to be able to sneak. That is the only requirement. If you're a good guy, you got to be able to run away. Not even that. You just got to be able to sell things, really. And overall, it's easy to run away from the guards. Let's be real here. It's really easy to run away from guards. So if you're fine with never entering cities in Oblivion, I mean, I guess you might have to find a place to sleep, which you could just go to an inn, and most of the time there's no guards there. So that's not a problem. I honestly really don't see a downside or an upside to being a criminal. Either way, it's your option. Now, if you want to play as a full criminal where you do not do any good guy things, then it's a little bit different. If you don't want to do any good guy things, which is pay off your bounties, you know, you're always breaking into places, then I actually think um, it's still balanced because you have access to the fences. You're not going to be able to buy a lot of stuff. There's still places to buy lockpick stuff from and poisons and stuff. And... If you're a criminal, you don't need to buy stuff from the alchemy store because you're probably stealing it. So, I think it's perfectly balanced. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I just honestly think there's no upside or downside to either one. I think it's whatever you want. I'm Busy the Couch Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games. And I will see you next episode, stream, or vlog of whatever I decide to make.